Lindsay Armonto and we're at the Combi in Orange, California and today you're going to be learning frontside inverts. Okay, some tricks that you might want to learn before you tr go and try frontside inverts is just regular inverts like just backside technique or even eggplants. Eggplants are really good just because it's the same grab as a frontside invert. One of the key things with frontside inverts, you really have to like push off the coping and just, like just huck it back in. Unlike other like inverts, like backside inverts, you can pretty much just like fall in and like I don't know, you'll be okay. But with frontside inverts, it's really really important to just that like initial push off. I think it's easiest and it looks cool to go straight up and then just once you get to your peak just like I said huck it in and straight back down and just roll away. If you go to a place that has a lot of vert, you'll be able to like pop off the coping and do the trick proper. There's no way to like really do it on a mini ramp. Like it's possible, but it's a lot more work and it just doesn't look as cool. So that's why you should like go to like a proper pool. To learn for learning frontside inverts, you're probably gonna want to learn how to do backside inverts first just because Learn, getting the whole feeling of being inverted or upside down and just learning hand plants is a good trick to learn in general and you're also so basically you're gonna have to like know how to drop in and whatnot but the key to front side inverts is I don't know there's no way to really work your way up into it you, I don't know you can kind of try it at the bottom of transition and just get the idea of putting weight on your hand try this at a place that has some like nice cool coping that doesn't stick out too much but then that there is like coping to pop off of it's a lot of com I don't know it's just a commitment trying it because the way you're like throwing your body is unlike any other trick really and that's how you frontside it. Today we're gonna start skating at the most convenient spot we call Queen's Park.